15, a goal after 20 seconds may remain the fastest in the Championship this season, but uh, you must be very pleased with the three points. Yeah, I'm delighted to get off to a winning start, of course. Um, it's a great way to start the game, 20 seconds, a very good team goal. And then, to be, and then after that, we, we lost control of the game for an hour. Uh, I mean, Coventry, in fairness, have played that system now for a couple of seasons and play it really well, and you can see that continuity. You know, we're still building, we're still in the very early stages, of course, but um, yeah, it's almost like we scored and then sort of came off the game a little bit. We allowed Coventry probably too much time in possession. They've got some good players who can hurt you. Um, having said that, we, we could have gone 2 0 with Fam's header. I thought their keeper made a good save from that. And, uh, and then Bents has, has made some big saves for us, in fairness. So uh, I thought after the changes, particularly in the second half, the last half an hour of the game was was how we want to play. We, you know, we passed the ball better. In the first half, we were going too long too early. Um, but we passed it better. We, we got after him. We were more aggressive in the press. Um, and he's hit a great strike off his left foot to, to hit the crossbar to maybe go three. So, uh, no, it was a good response second half. I was really pleased with that and great to get off to a winning start. You made the subs early after 55 minutes. Antoine Semenya last week, Tariq Bakinson this week. You must be very pleased with him in particular. Yeah, he was outstanding. And you could see his qualities with the ball. He took the ball in tight areas and, and kept kept us moving up the pitch in, in, with control and uh, yeah without the ball he made his tackles and, and, and say he put a he put a stop to a lot of the, the, the Coventry attacks so and the goal in all I think Thomas Callas at times in the first half and one in the second half he's defended the six yard box brilliantly I can, I can remember a Zach Vine block as well late on they're the things you've got to do to to win a game and uh, you know we had more of a focal point as the game wore on and, uh, it shows the importance of the, of the subs you know they've got to be ready, ready mentally and physically to come on and affect the game and um, I was pleased that they could come and do that. Just a word on your captain, uh, a goal, and uh, on the day he's announced as skipper, you must be very pleased with him. Yeah, he's Thomas, what a, what a way to, to start his first game or end his first game as captain with, with a winning goal. Uh, we're putting more demands on our defenders this year. We know the amount of goals we need to score to challenge at the top end, and uh, there's more demands on them to go and score goals. And you know, they've been working for 15, 20 minutes after every training session with Simo, doing you know, set piece execution and, and timing and going. You know, getting used to sticking the red on the ball to score rather than defending it. So you know, that paid fruition today, which was nice. Um, he's done great. He's in the last 24 hours. He's, he's shown a little motivational video before the game to the players. He took it on himself. I think he decided to, yesterday afternoon, and the media team have had to work four or five hours to to put a great video together, um, albeit with terrible music. I thought, but uh, maybe I'm just not cool enough to understand that. But no, it was nice. He took it on himself to you know to do that from within the group and that's what we want to do, create these leaders and uh, for him to get the winning goal today was, was, was really pleasing.